Hey everybody, William DiMaggio here with the Hood Team at Coldwell Banker Realty. Hope you're doing great today. Just want to take a minute to talk with you about earnest money. Uh, I get uh, questions a lot from buyers uh, about what is earnest money, how does it work. So uh, let's dive in real quick and, and uh, let's kind of give you a brief summary of what to expect when it comes to earnest money. So the most basic question is, what is earnest money? So earnest money shows the seller how earnestly a buyer wants a particular house. So if you're the buyer, how much are you willing to risk losing to show the seller how serious you are about not defaulting on the contract? How does earnest money work? Earnest money is held in trust by the escrow agent. This may be held by any number of entities, but the escrow agent is specified in our contract of sale. The money you put forward for earnest money will not be withdrawn until you have a ratified contract of sale. And at that point, it must be deposited in the escrow agent's account. If you're the buyer, once you get to closing, your earnest money will go to work for you. And it could go towards your closing costs or your down payment. If none of it or not all of it goes uh, uh, towards closing uh, or is utilized at the closing, and you'll receive the difference back, usually in the form of a check or wire transfer from the closing attorney. Why do I need to put earnest money down? A seller will not seriously consider an offer without some form of earnest money. So if you're the buyer, the seller is taking their home off the market for you and potentially losing other buyers. They want to see that you're willing to risk something to say that you're going to follow through with the promise that you've made to perform in the contract. Can I lose my earnest money? You can lose your earnest money if you default on the contract. There are contingencies built into the contract that if not fulfilled, your earnest money would be refunded to you. But typically you'll only use it in the event that you default. Now, how much earnest money is required? There is no written general rule or law stipulating that a certain amount of earnest money needs to be deposited. It's best to ask your realtor what they'd recommend for a particular price range or situation. However, in the end, the correct amount of earnest money is what the seller is willing to accept as a security to remove their home from the market. I hope this video helps answer any questions that you have about earnest money. If you wanna talk further about this, uh, please do not hesitate to give us a call at 803-730-2512. That's 803-730-2512. Please like and subscribe to our videos uh, uh, on our various social media platforms. And remember, here at the Hood Team, customer service is not a department, it's an attitude.